I try to come in as regularly as I can. So I'm in my studio, usually most weekdays, and I will stay there working for as long as my eyes allow me. By which I mean, I do a lot of um, very close order work, which means that sometimes my eyes start to strain badly. And I've learned that if that happens, I should give up and take a break and go home and do other things. So I try to work in the studio as regularly and as often as possible. The biggest thing I have to guard against is the studio getting filled up with material because I use a lot of collage. So I have a lot of books, magazines, pictorial material and so on in a relatively small space. And there can be times when I feel like I'm some sort of, you know, Victorian lawyer sitting in a tiny Dickensian office with everything around me. So I have to have periods where I clean everything out and start again. I've always been fascinated by puppets and masks. I think a great deal of my work is concerned with the different ways in which we wear masks, metaphorically. I mean, try as we might, we're not the same people when we're with our family or with work colleagues. We're not the same people. If you're 14 years old, for instance, you don't even talk the same way to your parents that you talk to your friends. So we wear masks all the time. And I've always found it a useful metaphor for how we live our lives. So I have masks around and I come back to it all the time, masks and puppets. There's the meaning and then there's the masked meaning. So studio practice, I think is in simplified terms is making sure that I work as regularly as often as I can. Um, making sure that work is productive because when I do work, I tend to work pretty rigorously. I keep going unless somebody interrupts me with great conversation. I think being part of the studio community here is, has been for me anyway, a very invigorating and productive experience. Um, I like the people who are in the studios. I enjoy their company. Um, I particularly enjoy having other artists around who you can run ideas by. That's, that's just fabulous. I think the fact that we have studios here in the building and also have the galleries available to us um, is a huge plus. If I get completely stuck, for instance, which I do, then I will just come and wander around the galleries and look at other people's work. I find that very, very helpful. But generally being a community of artists, I love it. I wouldn't change it for the world. I've been here since 2012 and I've never regretted the decision at all.